The type of photography that I love to create is fine art images. In the studio, I've been um, kind of using a mix of models and still life. Sometimes I torture my models by making them do weird, strange things. One of my favorite images is called Unravel, and that one I used Animoth as my model and I wrapped her entire head in yarn and she was such a trooper for that. She was so patient because <laughs> it didn't look comfortable, uh, I can tell you that much, but it was a lot of fun. We had a lot of fun doing that photo shoot together, um, but it always amazes me how willing people are to do these photo shoots with me. You know, I can call her up and be like, hey, do you want to get naked and have me wrap your head in yarn? And she's like, okay. And that's just so amazing. And so that was really cool and fun. <laughs> Another image that I created recently uh, is called Mask of the Red Death. And that is one that has been a work in progress. The, the first time I photographed that was in my apartment like eight years ago and at the time it was just a mask on the Edgar Allan Poe book and recently this last summer I've, I've been trying to think of different ways to make that a better image. Uh, I tried photographing it in my house again and it was a little bit better but not quite right and so uh, this winter, I created it again, <laughs> and I brought in more props. I brought in my skeleton and, you know, a violin and all these fun different elements to bring it to life. Another image that I've done, I, I have a life-size skeleton that I use often, and I brought that into the studio and did a whole old cat lady scene. I brought in a little cat skeleton and set up an old retro TV and just had a lot of fun with that. That was a really interesting one. Um, a lot of detail in the lighting. I like creating strange things like that, you know, just creating a story within my images is something that I love to do. 